creativity is an addiction. Unplugged because we will always say yes to creativity. Totally uncut because we all make mistakes. So let's turn it into a tool. This is Arrow Unplugged. Stream thinking. It's learning how to trust what's in your present. It's going to require some practice. Just one sheet of paper every day, 10 minutes, write about whatever is moving through your moment of what is right now. Absolutely no judgment. You see, stream thinking sharpens your skills as a listener, as a communicator, and as an activator. Learning how to trust what is right now. This is stream thinking. Today we're reading from April 1st, 2023. Has fitting in become the new uncool thing to do? To fit in at work means working well and communicating with others. Keeping a positive attitude. It's very essential. Fitting in at work is expected because we tend to give more when we're being cooperative with each other. If you don't feel like that you fit in, the experts, they're saying, hey, it's probably a good idea that you locate a new place of employment. The key tools are having the willingness to observe, then imitate, because it's very easy to feel excluded at the job. While some may say it's a lack of cultural skills, it can actually go deeper, a lack of confidence or being too shy. And yes, employers can fire you for that. 90% of all people have someone on the staff that they really don't like. You know what the professionals say? Fake it. Get over it. It is a way of life. Do you fit in? What do you do to make sure that you do fit in? Fitting in doesn't mean that you have to be the class clown or the class leader. Fitting in means that you're going to participate. All leaders have bosses above them. If they don't please those bosses, then it's going to trickle down to you. And sometimes it feels like those that are in charge are basically just bullies. When in fact, all they're trying to do is to motivate you. Participating with you by trying to fit in a moment where you might be down because things aren't going right. We don't know what's going on on the inside of your head just as much as you don't know what's going on inside of me. But when we fit into each other's day and we begin to respect each other's paths, things will begin to grow because we begin to understand the truer personality. Fitting in for me has required one thing, and that is I know that I come from several different careers and several different layers of jobs. So what I try to do is that I sit with those that do want to fit in and I invite them into my outside world. Just last night, I did a four-hour lecture. I invited a co-worker from one of the essential jobs to come and experience it. I asked him at the end, what did you learn tonight? He learned, he learned that I really do work one-on-one -on -one with trying to get people's dreams to pop open and blossom. At the other essential job, he doesn't get to see that because there are so many people above me that I just don't fit into that environment. But instead of fighting that environment, I invite those there to come into my world. And that's where we fit in together. So don't be a bump on a log. Don't be a judger. Don't be a taker. Invite people into your space. Fitting in becomes a part of the process. I'm Arrow, and that's Stream Thinking.